please welcome executive producer, World of Warcraft, Holly Longdale. Oh, she looks awesome. She looks so cool. Wow. What's up, BlizzCon? <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. Goals to see you for all. when I'm older. Fantastic. Well, can you believe we've been playing World of Warcraft for almost 20 years? <laughs> you know, 2004 was a while ago, right? You know, some of us, we waited in those lines for those midnight releases and got our discs. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> and we raced home to install those WoW discs one by one. <laughs> <laughs> Across nearly two decades, players all over the world have taken part in the stories of Jaina, Sylvanas, Arthas, <laughs> and Thrall, <laughs> and of course, so many others. And together, we've jumped through the portal into Outland. We sailed off into Northrend. And we watched Sargeras stab the world with that sword. Oh my god, are we gonna address that? <laughs> During that time, gaming has changed. And you have changed. And so have we, particularly in the past year. The entire team across both modern and classic have embraced their communities. We are truly listening to your voices and taking action. My friends at BlizzCon, now is the perfect time to prepare to close chapters, open new ones, and double down on why we all fell in love with World of Warcraft in the first place. <laughs> with that in mind, let's get to it. As many of you know, WoW Classic was born out of the community's passion. <laughs> the best. And of course, most of you know that still drives us today. Like just in August, inspired by our community, we released. Oh Hot yeah! Hardcore. So fun. <laughs> so much fun. So uh, in hardcore, you only get one life, and if you die, you may laugh, you may cry, you may have to replace a keyboard, uh, but you go again. <laughs> We've loved watching you take on the challenge or die trying. Uh, and because the hardcore community has asked, the team is planning to add a new way to play hardcore early next year. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> and last month in Wrath Classic, we released the Fall of the Lich King patch. <laughs> And while there's still more to come in Wrath, earlier this year, we looked at your feedback to think about where are we gonna go next? <laughs> we read through a lot, and I mean a lot of your feedback on social media forums, and we sent out surveys to our players. And here at BlizzCon, we're happy to announce Cataclysm is coming. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh, that's and crazy. It's coming with hashtag changes uh, <laughs> based on your feedback, just like you'd expect from Classic. So now, let's jump into the Wayback Machine and get a reminder of all things Cataclysm. It's so cool. Wow, what a vibe.
This is so cool. Neltorian, it is time to end this. Alex Strasser. Oh, it's so cool seeing these zones. Chokal. Night Elf looks awesome. Old him. Oh my god, these graphics are so cool to see. Firebands. Could you imagine playing WoW if it looked like this? That would be so cool. my friends because the I love the passion by the way uh, get ready my friends because the, the road to Deathwing's destruction is coming in the first half of next year all right now over the past four years of classic we've watched you master the vanilla experience and we've loved it so much in fact that we thought we'd add some unique flavor with a seasonal note and a dash of discovery. Season of discovery is vanilla wow <laughs> with a spicy twist. You're going to discover new secrets as you scour the world and find class altering abilities. So cool. <laughs> Have you ever wondered what it might be like to be a tanking warlock? Oh, what? <laughs> or take on the role of a mage healer? That's so cool. In Season of Discovery, you can. <laughs> the season is going to launch with an initial level cap of 25. And when you hit that max level, you'll be met with the brand new level 25 endgame. You'll discover a brand new 10-player Black Fathom Deeps raid with new and reimagined bosses, mechanics, and of course, rewards. Then, after a couple of months, we'll raise the level cap a bit. You'll find even more endgame content, and so it will go. If you're here at BlizzCon, you can play the Black Fathom Deeps raid in the Warcraft Hall. Oh, cool. I love Black Fathom <laughs> Deeps so much. So, if you love Classic or are just a little intrigued about what exactly a Warlock tank can do, Go check it out. <laughs> For all of you watching online, don't worry. You won't have to wait long to play. Because we want you to discover all of the secrets together, there will be no public testing. Cool. Wow Classic Season of Discovery That's the way to do launches it. in a few short weeks on November 30th. I know what I'm doing in December. How exciting! <laughs> For more information on the season of Discovery and Cataclysm, don't miss the classic panel this afternoon. All right, Stoked. now it's time to talk to my dragon riders in modern WoW. <laughs> Our team remains committed to giving you meaningful game updates about every eight weeks with more content sprinkled in between. We really want Azeroth to feel alive and the home you want to come back to no matter how you play. Our next major update, Guardians of the Dream, is going live in just five days. 
I, want I should to probably give play that. A shout out to my elves. It is finally our time. <laughs> I barely played Dragonflight, but I'll have to play One for this. One week later, season three will start with the last raid of the expansion, Amir Drasil, the Dream's Hope. There we will have our final showdown with Farak and defend our new world tree. But fear not, that's not the end of our time in the Dragon Isles. There's a lot more to come in Dragonflight that will serve as both the epilogue of this story and the bridge to our next one.